Hi guys, Snake Dodder here. Welcome back to Chaos on Deponia. Right, well last time we've managed to uh, finally get <coughs> Gold, uh, an invitation to dinner for Gold. Uh, she was wanting us to take her out and we had to convince old Captain Seagull, um, Rufus's dad, to give us the get us the reservation sorted. And to do that we had to get all the, uh, the duckbill platypuses off the menu at the restaurant, which we've now done. So I think now really we should go and uh, go to the tavern here and... Uh, give this invite to Lady Goal herself. Hopefully it's the right version of Lady Goal. Let's just see if it is. Can't remember if it's which version of Goal we left behind, but uh hopefully it's what that one. Have you got this time? Sounds like her. Well what do you think? This is an official invitation to a romantic dinner. Oh really? Really? Hmm. This invitation actually meets all the rules of etiquette. Bravo Rufus. Apparently, I was completely wrong about you. Wait for me later in the old town, all right? I'm looking okay. forward to being able to lay aside a few more prejudices against you and Deponia. Lay aside certainly sounds great. <laughs> oh, Rufus. Right, so what's happening now? Oh, Why Rufus. Look at you. Huh. I might have guessed that Dad doesn't know the first thing about women. With his terrific tips, it's a miracle that I exist at all. Romance and flowers, my ass. I'm going to let him have it. God, Dad? Is... Oh, no. What's been going on here? Flowers? Champagne? That louse! If this is what it looks like, the old philanderer might as well ooh, start digging the grave for his burial at sea. Right. Not very nice. So his dad's uh, basically he's he's wooed gold himself. Radiant equipment equipment memo. Let's have a look at that. Let's grab that, shall we? What's this? I need a radio. Why would the old fart need a radio? Unless Whoa! I don't believe it. First he steals my date, and then my brilliant idea with the prompter. That miserable old dirtbag. We'll have that. Let's go and see the poet, shall we? Kane downstairs. Kane? Never remember his name. Okay, let's go and see him. Let's see what he says. Just see if we can see if we can grab his crane. That's his name, Crane. Knock knock. Hmm. You again. Yes. Um, right, what can we let's borrow his radio. I really need to borrow your radio. Never! Oh, come on! From one... I am a bard. You, however, ought to be bard. <laughs> but no. Okay. Uh, what can we do? Must be a way of doing it, surely. I bet we give him. Let's give him the memo. Maybe he needs a radio because then. See you later. He thinks right. that uh, Captain Leave Seagull will take that himself, won't he? Let's uh, give him that. Crane, crane. What is it? I found something. One last. No, little. Don't say <laughs> it. Memo. He needs a radio. I need a radio. Are you dictating these memos to him? Don't change the no. subject. Just give me the radio. Why do you have to do this anyway? I won't say. Do I have to get a memo that says I need secrets? Oh, stock market news. Oh, come on, Crane. Right. Let's go. Let's try and salvage something out of this date. Uh, the restaurant. Let's go to. Uh, let's go to the restaurant. There if he that is. Look. Beat all. Unbelievable. Stealing my date from right under my nose. Your own son. Uh, excuse me. You're Rufus's father. He seems to think that. But I'm not. That is totally... Oh. I took him in when I was still mayor of Kuvak. We found him in the garbage. 
kicking and screaming. He's a trash baby. That isn't true! Examine your feelings, Rufus. I am not your father. Rufus. Now you tell me? Have Poor you no thing. decency? Huh? Look who's talking. Cole, you don't understand. This guy has... Has what? Standing? Style. A clean suit. You see, unlike you, the captain knows how to treat a lady. But... You heard the lady. Do I really need to call an attendant and have you removed by force, kicking and screaming? Oh no, what are you gonna like do? Just like the trash baby that you are? Really? I'll get you for this. Oh, has the wind changed? Something smells a bit off. Just an insignificant little breeze, dear, that's all. I, 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 I... Right, I wonder... All right, so I farted. <laughs> but that doesn't make him better than me. I am so gonna rain on his parade. I will teach him a lesson so tough that it was dropped from the curriculum of the School of Hard Knocks. Well, I mean, that tough, eh? Okay. I reckon we could... Do the radio. Hey. Okay, do his poem. You know about poetry, right? Sure thing. One of my platypus poems even made it to page three of the Platypus Daily. I see I've come to the right place. Here. Watch this. Radio? Oh, yeah. You'll need it. It's uh, a romantic matter. <laughs> platypus romance or human romance? This is going to ruin it Captain's date. I have prepared something very special for you. The icing on the cake. A poem in your honor. Okay, here we go. The poem. Pardon me? <clears throat> the poem. <clears throat> go ahead. That was your cue. Oh, oh, I've got just the thing. Give it your all. You are cuter than a batty wuss. <laughs> <laughs> He's making a right mess of this for him. You look just like a platypus. Platypus? <laughs> oh. Dear. <laughs> hey, uh, go on, yuck. go. What? Hey, what the? Wait. You were right, Rufus. Seagull is an idiot. It was very noble of you to try and warn me about him. Thank you. <laughs> oh, Rufus, he lucks in. <laughs> right. I owe you an apology, Rufus. Your foster father may act all sophisticated, but in reality, he is nothing but a subilluminated cerebral pygmy. Indeed. Yeah, just without the stripes. Now all I have to do is persuade your two other aspects. I'm sure you will find right. that. And I should know. The others are a part of me, after all. To tell you the truth, I liked you right from the start. You are a lot like Cletus, but you have a real backbone, and you aren't such a sissy. That's true, uh, but don't tell him I said that. I had better stay here until you manage to persuade the other two. I must admit right. that I'm actually a little jealous. Totally weird, isn't it? Right, well, let's use the remote uh, on her and see what goal we get. We get Spunky or Baby? Let's do Spunky. I think we need to oops, huh? rebooting. The... Everything okay? Yeah, it's fine. I'll have the same again. Okay. Now, we need to kind of pick a fight with her, don't we, really? Why, hello, doll. You come here often. Why, hello, doll. Come here often. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> <coughs> Why, hello, doll. Come here often. Is that supposed to be funny? I... but... First, you drag me off, and then you try to be cute? Why hasn't it occurred to you that I might be well and truly pissed off? Good, it's working. Uh, well, why? Hello, doll. Come here often. <laughs> Smack. Here we go. Whoa! No brawling in my bar. This may be the favorite hangout of the lowest scum in town, but some rules still apply, you know. He started it. I haven't done a thing. Yeah, he's got a point. Running around like an idiot ain't a crime. Hey! But maybe being an idiot is. I said, hey! <laughs> You're lucky I don't hit women. Go ahead and try. Maybe I'll start by giving you a good spanking. 
If you Maybe. fancy a broken jaw, be my guest. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here in the floating black market, we settle our differences in a civilized okay. manner. There is only one way to get you two to quit your bickering. Platypus Pataka. What's that? We're about to find out. <laughs> this goal looking all Bring feisty. It on. Imagine this is me looking all uh, sheep sheepish, I would think. <laughs> Got the platypus outfit on. It's on! Let's get ready for another boil and groan! Oh, yeah. what do to do here then? Uh, head. He's just kicking me in rather badly. Okay, that clearly didn't work at all. That doesn't mean a thing. I let her win on purpose. On the other hand, it might not be a bad idea to train my infamous okay. Rufus reflexes. So what do we do? So I see right. I've just seen these pictures in the background now. So when the, your opponent's looking down, when Gold's looking down at your feet, you move the cursor to the feet, which blocks. And then when I look at her feet, hopefully I can do that. Right, let's try. Let's try what hitting an ugly this training then. Dummy. I will beat it up with great pleasure. Not that I really need any training. All right, I'll give it a try. Just give it one go. I have no idea what's happening. What the bloody hell is happening? Ah, oh, sod this, right. Yeah, let's get the minigame, come on. <laughs> yeah, put him in his place. Now this must have permanently improved my reflexes. Alright, let's go back and try this again, because... We need to do something about this one to get this through here. Here we go. Bring it on! Yes, we've seen this. Come on. I'll give it one go. If this doesn't work, we'll skip it, I think. Because, to be honest with you, mini games are fine, but I want to see how the story progresses. It's on! That's the way she's looking. Let's get ready for another boil and roll! Platypus Bataka. Okay. What the? Oh. I don't get it. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh shit, it's too quick. Oh, I see. Right, I've got it now. Don't shield your balls. <laughs> Aha! Right. Give up already. Ow! Walking silly bonus. Coward move. Head again. Ow! She's going for my head. I'm going to hit her legs. Feet. Resistance is futile. Feet again. Maybe one more. Rage move. Head. Come on. This is the one. Uh, oh, you bastard! Damn. Too slow. Shit. <laughs> Nearly had it then. Fucker. I'm going to do this. 
I now know what I'm doing. That doesn't mean a thing. I let her win on purpose. Yeah, we know, Rufus. On the other hand... Nope, I don't need to. Come on, let's watch the bloody point. I would have to do it again. Go for that. Okay. Atmos Bataka again, we know. Come on. Here we go. Feet. Head. Box it. Feet. Head. Feet. Feet. Head. Body. Feet. Body again. Feet again. Come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right. Pissed off now. What is the rage mode about? You get her right to the end. And then... Then it works. Then, you you know, then all of a sudden we're doing it. Right. Balls to this. I'm going to skip it. That doesn't mean a thing. I let her win on purpose. On the other hand, it might not be a bad idea to train my infamous Rufus reflexes. Yeah, come on. It's on. Yeah, we know. Let's get ready for another boiling drone of Platypus Plataka. Or not. Uh, Let's just skip the Platypus Plataka. And yes, we will skip the mini game. Uh, really, that's our uh, victory, uh, our victory uh, animation. Exploded. Oh, that spunky goal impressed. Just a baby goal now to sort out, and we're done. That was fun. Huh, that was fun. Maybe you're not the little idiot I took you for after all. That's because people tend to overlook my true greatness. Now all I have to do is persuade your last alter ego. To tell you the truth. I liked you right from the start. You are a lot like Cletus, only without his attitude and his misguided sense of superiority. So. That's true. I'm totally laid back. And you exude a certain air of neglect that makes you very attractive to women. Thanks. Brilliant. I think. I'd better stay here until you manage to persuade the other two. Well, I must I've admit, done two now, so just baby go left. Jealous. Totally weird, isn't it? Right, well, I think for now, we'll call that a day. We've done Spunky Goal and Lady Goal. Just got to get to Baby Goal now. And, uh, yeah, we'll be we'll be rocking and rolling. So, for now, guys, I've been Snake Doctor. Please remember to like, share, and favourite the video. And subscribe to my channel to see all these, uh, this rest of this Chaos and Deponia videos and whatever else I put on the channel. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Bye-bye. <laughs>